Hey everybody, this is Ryan, and welcome to a new series on an adventure map. This adventure map is called The Ancient Spirits of Light and Darkness, and we're going to go ahead and uh, just immediately get going. The, uh, the link for it and all that stuff will be in the description below. And, uh, you know, just like any adventure map, you, uh, you're not supposed to use uh, any of your tools. I'm just going to put them aside for now. And um, don't take stuff from mannequins. Read signs. Don't break blocks. Uh, pretty, pretty simple, basic stuff. Welcome to Terraria, stranger. This is the town of World's End, on the edge of the realms of men. When we found you, you were nearly dead, but our nurse managed to patch you up. We don't know who you are, but all newcomers have to go and see the mayor on the other side of town. Good luck. Good luck just to go see the mayor? Wow. That is a harsh, harsh town. <laughs> Hope you don't die trying to get to the other side of town. That's all just rules. Basic rules and stuff. The Great Wall of Terraria. This historic monument built by the first men that inhabited the land to protect humanity from the corruption that has been standing for thousands of years. Apparently, also, it uh, shows when they cut down every single tree in the world. <laughs> because that is a pretty massive wall of dead trees. Can we play the song? I think we did. Um, Chief Scout's Quarters. These forges are imported straight from the underworld. Hell is one of the only civilizations left not part of the Hallowed Empire. Stupid if you ask me. They don't have anyone to protect them when the corruption comes to their land and their souls. Don't be telling people how to live their lives. Once you get kitted out, could you do me a favor? We lost contact with a village to the west of here. We get a lot of raiders from far west, so I'm afraid it's been hit. If you go check it out, there'll be a reward in it for you. Quest. Travel west to the village and speak to the arms dealer. Um, gotta go get the key to open that. Hmm. Well, let's go find the mayor. Let's not read too many signs until we get to the good old mayor. There's a wizard. Is the wizard the mayor? Uh, no. The wizard is the wizard. So, that makes sense. Hi, stranger. Nice to see you're feeling better. I saved your life, you know. When we found you, you were almost cut in half. Good thing I worked miracles with a needle and some thread. So I made out of, like, cloth then? Good to know. That might be the mayor. But we're already halfway up this thing. Well worth my time. <laughs> and your time, for that matter. Hey, stranger. I'm the chief scout. I organize the town guard and run expeditions beyond the wall. Say, you look like the kind of guy who could help me out. The giant eye from the corruption has been harassing us. Our archers have kept it at bay, but I want it taken care of. Quest. Use the underground tunnel under the wall near the silver mines to enter the corruption. Reach the outpost and then kill the eye. Note, it is recommended that you obtain the handgun before you attempt it. Alright, now I'm pretty sure... Only read when you complete complete the quest. Okay, yeah, so... I haven't done that yet, so I'm not gonna read the sign. Below lie the silver mines, which keep this town on its feet. Alright. Town guard training area... I hate this place. God, I hate it. It's so cold, and there's something in the air. Something evil. I've lived in the Hallowstone slums my entire life, and now I'm here, in the jaws of the corruption. It can't be any worse than those awful slums, I suppose. Hello, Traveler. I'm the Drill Sergeant. 
It's my job to beat some discipline into these slugs. Although I must say that I was frozen with fear the first time I set foot in this place. I was a major back then. I... I balked. An important moment. Got a lot of my men killed. And now I'm here. The worst assignment in the Empire. I don't want to talk about it. Uh, pretty excellent writing so far, I gotta say. Did I go up here? Oh, Town Hall. The mayor's office is upstairs. Well. Well, well, well. Hey, stranger. I'm the mayor. And apparently you are naked. You are a naked mannequin. Okay. Makes sense. We don't see many strangers around here. Anyway, it's dangerous out there, so you should get kitted out. Go see the blacksmith for some armor and tools, and the wizard for potions. Take these take these keys with you. They'll know I gave you permission. Also, they will no doubt have some jobs for you. And also, check out the chief scout on the eastern side of town. He always needs things done. I got two keys! Nothing in the trash can. But I have two keys. Bill the Wizard. Classic wizard name. Hello, stranger. I'm Bill, the local wizard. Of course, I don't get to converse with many who share my passion for magic. You aren't. No, I thought not. Anyway, take what you want from my stores. If you can afford it. Ha. <laughs> Jerk. Do not read. Listen, I have a little problem. I was exploring a cave not far from here a little while ago and lost my old wizard hat. The new one really isn't my style. There isn't any chance you could help me out, is there? Quest! Go do Crystal Shine Cave to the West and recover Bill's wizard hat. The mayor said I could uh, take your stuff. So I'm going to steal that. I only give equipment when the mayor authorizes it. Come back here if you have a golden key. Otherwise, get out. Iron chainmail. And I'll take those torches. And I'll take that sword. You can do just about anything with the silver broadsword. So, I should be pretty unstoppable at this point. All right, onwards to the village that was said to be in this direction. And got him! Ha <laughs> ha! Success. Oh man. I'm hitting switches. Probably not a good thing. How do I get in there? A little mimic chest. Alright, I'll just leave you in your little horrible tomb of death there. See you later. Diary. Clark Rockarm. Explorer. God, what have I gotten myself into? That stupid wizard sent me here to get his hat from this godforsaken cave. And for what? A handful of silver? I expected easy money. Anyway, I'll set up camp here and continue tomorrow. Seriously? I mean, look, look. I'm out. Oh my god, I did it. Seriously, you're that worried? Stop being a baby. Uh-oh. I don't like the looks of that. Do not like the looks of that. Maybe clock rock arm was onto something. Platform in, jumping across the blocks. Success. Diary. Clock rock arm continued. When I get back, I'm going to show that wizard what I think of him. That stupid oaf. This place is a death trap. I fell in twice getting here, and the water is freezing. Good thing I brought those flippers. After this, I've got a mind to keep that wizard hat for myself. Imagine that. 
Clark the Wizard! Ha! Yeah, imagine that. That's, that's something crazy. Clark, I really don't like you. Diary of Clock Rock Arm continued. The cave is so dark. Oh, what I would do to see daylight again. But alas, I must press on for there is a wizard hat to be found and enemies to be vanquished. Okay, I kind of like you now. I'm back to kind of liking you. Hey, thanks for the pistol. I imagine for some reason you left that behind, Clark. Hmm. Hmm. All right. I think speed is my friend here. So many slimes. Lever. Lever has to be good. Maybe? Probably not. Oh, man. Please don't die. Please don't die. All right. Clock rock arm, you are a huge baby. I gotta say. Did you just give up and live here? Clark the wizard. <laughs> Alright, that's kind of funny. <laughs> Hello, fellow traveler. Wow, I, I almost gave up hope that I would ever speak to another human being again. Why didn't I leave, you might ask? Well, that is simple. I decided I rather liked the thought of being a wizard myself. Crazy? Well, I call you crazy for coming down here. An accomplished wizard such as myself would never be so reckless. Now go, messenger boy. Tell your master that the hat is mine. Ha ha ha. I added in that laugh for dramatic effect. I can just kill you pretty easily. Clark has obviously gone mad. He clearly does not want to part with the hat. Oh well. Well, I killed his pet rabbit. So, take that, Clark, you jerk. <laughs>